above, Amman looks like it must have looked a thousand years ago. Home to more than four million people, Amman is one of the oldest, continuously inhabited cities in the world. Sprawling over more than 600 square miles, Amman's land area is bigger than Chicago, Boston, and New York City combined. Speaking of American cities, at one time, Amman was called Philadelphia. That's Greek for city of brotherly love. The ancient Romans also left their mark on Amman. There's a giant amphitheater cut into a hillside. These are the remains of a Roman temple. It doesn't look like much today. But here's what an artist thinks it may have looked like back in the days of the empire. Rising above the skyline is the beautiful dome of the Blue Mosque. It invites even non-Muslims to visit. It's really huge inside, with room for 10,000 worshipers. And right across the street is a Christian church. Besides sightseeing, Amman offers plenty of options for shopping, including street bazaars. Merchants have been displaying their wares in the open air like this for thousands of years, though the products they sell have certainly changed over time. So have some of the buildings. Mortar and stone are slowly giving way to glass and steel. Paved highways have replaced the time-worn dirt trails caravans used to travel. And while Jordanians are proud of their many traditional dishes, they are also open to sampling American tastes. In fact, Amman is considered one of the most westernized and liberal Arabic cities in the Middle East. For Teen Kids News, I'm Olivia.